Good morning from Palm Desert, California. This morning we're going to try an experiment and by using the keyframe feature on the Skydio 2 and the Skydio 2 Plus app. The feature allows you to set multiple points where the aircraft will then fly on autonomous flight mode. I'm going to set up a number of keyframe points to form a flight helix around this bridge, a pedestrian bridge, down through the short uh, length of the bridge. This is an experiment to see if multiple keyframes will work and if the autonomous obstacle avoidance features of the Skydio 2, actually this is a Skydio 2 Plus I'll be flying today, and to see if the Skydio 2 Plus uh, actually is able to perform and complete a helix flight uh, mission uh, using the keyframe uh, feature. Uh, we're going to give it a try. I'm going to walk you through the process as to how we do it and then we'll take a look at the end result. This is an experiment so let's take a look and see if it actually works. Started off in manual mode to set up the keyframe start sequence and then I move to keyframe within the cinematic and you start adding keyframes. So I start here. This is my first keyframe. And we quickly add another one here. Here we go. Then I moved the Skydio 2 Plus down. Uh, closer, kind of give a cinematic move, and I added a keyframe. And then I moved it ahead uh, over the bridge, place it to the point where I would start the helix spiral, and added a keyframe. And my first uh, go at this was to create a helix that was essentially clockwise. So move out over the bridge, add a keyframe, now move down. Add a keyframe, now move over. I was taking a peek here to make sure that I could move over easily. Move over under the bridge. And add a keyframe. Now move up. And a little bit of a head. Add a keyframe. Then move back over the bridge in a clockwise motion. Add a keyframe. Now move down. Move ahead a little bit. Add a keyframe. Then I moved under the bridge. and add a keyframe. Then I decided to change things up a bit, add a keyframe, but then move counterclockwise. So we are changing in the middle of the helix from a clockwise uh, motion to a counterclockwise motion, and I wanted to see if the Skydio would pick that up. 
under the bridge, forward a little bit, add a keyframe. Move up, add a keyframe, move back over the bridge, add a keyframe, move down below the bridge, add a keyframe, move forward a little bit to advance the helix, move over under the bridge, Add a keyframe, up again, add a keyframe, over the bridge, add a keyframe. Down one more time. Add the keyframe. Take a little bit of a look here as to where I'm flying. <laughs> because I was getting pretty close to the wall and I wanted to make sure that I'd get it positioned. Turn the sky deal looking forward at the wall, add the keyframe, raise it up, add the keyframe, take another look to make sure that I was, uh, my airspace was clear. Add a keyframe and I pressed done and at that point it started flying backwards through the keyframes that I had set. So you're now seeing what the screen shows in terms of it completing the mission going through the keyframes backwards to the beginning of where I started the keyframes. And you can actually see the keyframe uh, positions and the flight path there on the screen as I'm into the keyframe feature on the app. But this time I'm figuring out this is going to work. And here is where I reversed the uh, helix from clockwise to counterclockwise and the Skydio performed that particular uh, maneuver without, uh, without fail. And we're back to the position of the first keyframe. At this point, I want to do uh, run it uh, forward from the initial keyframe. And here we go.
And here's where it performs the going from clockwise to counterclockwise. Once again, flying forward, no problem on executing that particular maneuver. All right, this gives you an idea as to how it looks on the screen as you're setting it up. And uh, what will come next is I'll post uh, the actual video from the camera on the Skydia so that you can see it with better resolution.
And that, my friends, is the Helix Maneuver using the Skydio 2 uh, UAS and the Skydio app. Uh, tune in from time to time as I cover more items of interest to Skydio pilots. Ha, 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 ha.